Hey friends, today on Due to the Travel Bug, you know our family loves a good aquarium, and we hit most of the big ones in the U.S., but today we discover a small jewel in Northern California. Ocean World Aquarium was built in 1964 in Seattle as a barge, a giant flat bottom boat that was then floated down to Crescent City, California. Guests would descend below deck of the barge and view sea life through underwater windows. In 1985, the barge was moved to dry land and large tanks were installed. When you arrive at the aquarium, all guests purchase tickets and then gather in the gift shop and wait for their guided tour to begin. The aquarium is broken into four sections. Our tour started with the touch and feel tide pool, where we could observe, touch and learn about the tide pool life of sea anemones, sea stars, nudibranchs, sea slugs, and this guy, a gumboot chitin. The best part of Ocean World Aquarium is that the sea life all lives within the shores of the Pacific Northwest. So as our trip continued, our kids were able to look for and identify the wildlife that surrounded them. Next up, we entered the barge and headed below deck to their rocky bottom environment, where we got to view some pretty amazing local sea life like rockfish, leopard shark, sturgeon, playful sea lions, and the super unique looking bat ray. Our tour then headed back up to the shark gallery where the kids got the awesome chance to pet a real leopard shark. Leopard sharks are typically four to five feet long with large spot markings on their back, swim along the Pacific coast of North America, and it's pretty much harmless to humans. And before moving on, there are some great shark photo ops. The shark swallow you whole. And we found out that a hammerhead shark totally has dad beat. And lastly, we head outside for the grand finale, the sea lion and harbor seal presentation. For more unique travel shows, like and subscribe to see where Doodlebug goes next.